am Ezra, and this is a review of the. I keep saying Clone Wars. The 2005, I believe, correct me if I'm wrong, Star Wars Ultimate Build Your Own Lightsaber Kit. Wow, that's a mouthful. Um, but uh, yeah, I'm going to give a shout out to Justin Logan. Um, he commented on one of my videos saying that he wants me to review a force effects a, a force effects lightsaber, and I'm sorry, but I don't have any. Uh, so this review is in place of if I did have an an ultimate effects lightsaber, I would review it. So this is in place of that. So yeah, so thank you for commenting. Thank you for commenting on one of my videos. So let's take a look at the packaging first here. Crawl in and grab it. So here it is. It's very big, so I'm gonna have to pick the camera. So here it is. Um, the ultimate build your own large rubber gooch. Uh, so yeah, it has some cool artwork. Some cool artwork. A uh, very nice artwork there. This is actually a package variant. There's another variant of the package. If I can flip this around, all right. Um, it gives some examples of what you can build with the kit. Um, it has some scenes from the movie when lightsaber were used. It has the contents, kind of, of the kit. It came with some instructions that I have. I'm not going to show them to you because who cares about that junk. But, um, yeah. So that is it for the... For the box here, so I'll put this back. Okay, so getting to the contents of the kit, there it comes with a hilt here. Um, it needs to C batteries. C batteries, guys. C batteries. Um, comes with two sleeve rings. I think that they're called. Correct me if I'm wrong in any of this stuff. Um, it comes with two end caps right here. Uh, that one's on the screen. There we go. Two end caps. This is Obi-Wan Kenobi's end cap, and this is just a generic one. Um, it comes with some sleeves like this, this, and this. So there's these guys. It comes with this. This, 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 and three kyber crystals, and three light filters. That's a lot. So, the first thing you want to do to actually build uh, your lightsaber is you're going to want to pick a kyber crystal. So, you're going to want to open this up, and I'm going to go with red because I like dark side. Yay. Uh, <laughs> go dark side. But you are going to orient it the way that it wants to go. And you are just going to snap it down in there. And the purpose of these kyber crystals is that I can't get the door closed. Mm, that's not the purpose of it. But that is a thing. There we go. Um, it's to change the sound of the lightsaber. Um, next... You are going to, oh, and I forgot some contents. We do have these two blades. So you can either do, you can either use this Sith blade or this clear blade. So you can make a double bladed lightsaber with this kit. That's when you use the clear blade. So clear blade is for colors blue, green, and red versus this one is only for red. So this is the one that you would hook on to the bottom of your lightsaber, and you can also put it on the top. So it's pretty cool. So I'm gonna go with the clear for the purpose of this review, and I am going to pick an emitter here, and I'm gonna pick this Darth Maul one. And what you wanna do is you want to put it on top of the thing, and then the emitter, and then you just push the blade up through it. See that? It's kinda cool, and that's how that goes. Then you're going to want to take uh, your light filter, which 
changes the color of the blaze. We're going to put the red one in there. Then you're going to take the actual light housing and you're going to screw it in. Like that. Next, you're going to take that whole assembly that you just made right there and you're going to screw it onto the hilt. Just like this. All right, there we are. Uh, next, you're gonna just customize your hilt with different rings and stuff. Uh, so you can put on, put on this ring. There it is, like uh, that. Um, sorry, just moved the camera. So you're gonna put one on like that. Um, you're going to put like one on like whatever. Uh, you can also use like this button here. Um, now I'm going to use this, da, 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 da. and then I'm going to take this, screw this on. All right, I just completed the lightsaber. So here it is, guys. The lightsaber. You can flick it out, and the blade is very long, so let's light it up. Yeah, nice ring, very nice red there. The, it's actually more red in real life than it is um, on camera, but uh, this is the sound. Yeah, so very cool. This is the turn on button. And you can actually, that's what I use for my stand by the way, uh, you can actually customize it a little bit more. Here, by taking this end cap piece off, like so, and putting on this, which is actually called a adapter, I believe. Um, and that just screws on just like that. And then you take your other emitter here, and you put it on just like this. And then you screw it into the back of it and this is where it gets very very cool okay that's screwed on camera so let's see now you have a send that out send that out you now have let me just bring it back a little bit a double bladed Red lightsaber. It actually makes sound when you hit both sides. So that's pretty cool. Only one side lights up because this side doesn't. But yeah, it's still awesome. It's really cool. So yeah, that about wraps it up for this Star Wars Build Your Own Lightsaber Kit Review. So remember, I am Ezra and may the force be with you.